So I'm watching this uh, CB loose video again. I, I watch a few of them um, every once in a while because it's nice to get an idea of what other feminists, other than the ones that are running the media, etc., uh, feel about certain issues. Uh, the one thing that I've noticed is uh, a tendency to talk about feminism as something that needs improvement from within. Now, I can understand the desire to hang on to a political label that you and yourself have enjoyed uh, and identify with. Um, and also, I understand and appreciate, by the way, the morality and the, um, the compassion behind the idea of wanting equality of the sexes. But here, here's where this whole thing falls down. Even in these C.B. Luce Institute videos where they're talking about certain portions of feminism and how it fails to live up to its expectations, fails to live up to its reputation, its name, etc. Uh, which, you know, they, they actually talk about certain flaws within feminist theory and uh, certain types of radicals that have taken it over. But what they don't do is they don't talk about actual equality issues anymore. You know, it's it's funny. I mean, the, there's there's the ones on the radical left who scream, kick, bitch, and moan that there's all these things and all these reasons why women are heavily oppressed and oh my god, somebody and so, somebody must think of the children. Oh my god, these people over here basically are the only ones that are listened to by the media, by politicians, etc., etc., etc. There's a very very tiny group that seems to be of conservative feminists who are largely opposed to this, this group here, and they're actually, it seems, a lot more equality driven. However, your incredible lack of concern and your, shall we say, conspicuous um, lack of action on actual equality rights, okay, equality issues, where both sexes are definitely treated very differently from each other, and to the point where even a feminist has to admit that there are massive inequalities going on in society, even with things that bad, and even though you are the most associated with equality within the feminist movement, you have still done fuck all about it. Nothing. Not a thing. You don't even talk about it. You don't talk about the issues. You don't talk about the stats from both sides. You don't say things like men don't have reproductive rights and that's wrong and we have to. And here's the key part. And we have to do something about it. You never do that. You say there's these inequalities and that sucks for men. And we, well, of course, there's still these ones for women as well. Way to gloss it over. Fantastic. You fulfilled your quota of having to actually mention that men are not necessarily the privileged oppressors that we've been cast as for the last 40 years. Oh no, you filled that quota in, but you nicely tied it off with a, but women are more important. Or women are more our thing. You have a responsibility as a member of the feminist movement. If you insist on taking that name and tagging yourself with that ideology, then you have a major responsibility ahead of you. And I'm definitely going to hold you guys to this. If this, if this is going to be your argument that feminism is correcting itself, then you fucking well better get started on it. And I mean right now. I want to see some fucking videos or something. And I, I'm pretty sure I speak for an awful lot of guys when I say, I will believe that you guys are about equality the minute that I actually see something change because you guys tried to get it to change. When I see feminists actually trying to fix the shit that feminists had happen in the first place, then I might believe that you people are actually about equality. When I see you guys preaching the right stuff. When I see you guys saying, you know what, yes, there's this much domestic violence for women, but here's the thing, there's this much for men, and there's definitely a need for something to be done. When I hear things like, yes, there are still barriers in the workplace for women, but education is 80% female, 
medical care is over 75% female. Men have lost 80% of all of the jobs in this recession. And there is a problem with education because men are dropping out like crazy. And we need to do something about it. That's the last part. And we need to do something about it. I'm sick to fucking death of hearing these, it's men's problem, men should take care of it. You know what? You did it. You made this fucking happen. You lobbied and you worked and you fucking dug deep to make all these things happen. And if you didn't do it, then your four, four sisters or four mothers did. And you took the label of feminism and that makes you personally fucking responsible for all the stuff that's going on. So here's the thing. Fix it or fuck off.